Hello all, welcome to another quick learning. Today we're going back to code signal, we're going to Python coding exercises. If you're joining this in the middle of a playlist and you want to go back to the first video, I'll put a link in the description below so you can start there. Otherwise I'm going to go to the arcade, I'm going to go to Python, and then we're in this new section, Fumbling and Functional, number 35, Chess Teams. So Grand Team Chess Tournament will be held at your university. Two teams, Smarties and Cleveries, will clash to determine whose chess skills are better. The teams have the same number of members, and the ith member of Smarties will play the ith member of Cleveries in the ith game for each valid eye. Given the name of the players of both Smarties and Cleveries, return the games in the orders they will be played. All right, so you've got a list of Smarties, Jane, Bob, Peter, and Cleveries, Oscar, Lydia, and Anne. So in the games, Jane should be paired with Oscar, Bob with Lydia, and Peter with Anne. So you see here you got a list, and then in those lists you have another list uh, with two people paired up uh, as you go down the list. So how would you implement that in code? So one way to do it is through a list comprehension like we've been doing. So in this one, uh, we're going to cycle through different eyes because they're talking about, you know, I, we'll just use I, you can use X or whatever you want, and we're going to cycle through a range that is the length of Smarties, so in this case, uh, we've got three names, so it's going to be uh, a range of range three, so it's going to go zero, one, two, so we're going to do Smarties index zero, with Cleveries index zero, and then Smarties index one, Cleveries index one, etc., and they're going to add those to the list. So we do that. You can see that that passes. Uh, another way you could do it is use the zip function. So if we do list and then zip smarties, comma cleveries, you'll see that that accomplishes the same thing. What zip does is it just pairs them up uh, as you go down the index. So the zero was zero from this list and then one from one uh, from these next lists. All right. Hope you guys are able to follow along with it and I hope you join me for future videos. Thank you very much.